Hello, Iris. Hello, Christian. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening, teacher. I'm fine. How was your day? How was your day? Eh, pesado, no, no me... Heavy es pesado. Heavy no, es pesado. Eh, eh, very heavy. <laughs> very heavy. Why? What did you do today? Because, este, because I, I've, eh, he estado haciendo muchas tareas, no, no sé, me, uh, no, no sé cómo formular esa respuesta, eh, because I, I, I have, I have uh -huh. been doing a lot of Homework. I have been doing a lot of homework. Okay. I have I have been doing uh oh, estado haciendo un montón de tareas. Okay, thank you, teacher. Nice, nice. And where do you study? Uh, I study in Icha. Uh, in city of Chalatenango. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice. Nice. And do you like your career? ¿Qué, qué carrera estudio, algo así? Yes. I, I study engineering civil, pero es técnico. Es una, una carrera técnica de ingeniería civil. Oh, civil engineering. Nice. Yeah. Yes. Excellent. Hello, Claudia. How are you? Construction. Construction. Oh, yeah. Nice. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? How was your day today? How was your day today? Fine. What did you do today? What did you do today? Mm. Okay, I think she has problems with the microphone. Eh, la pregunta sería, ¿qué hizo hoy? What did you do today? Um, I studying. Oh, no sé cómo decir. Fui a estudiar. I uh, uh, I went to the university. I, I went. I went to the university. Si fui a la universidad. Correct. Yes. The university. Excellent. What is your career? Um, no sé, de ingeniería en sistema. Uh -huh. okay. Systems engineering. System engineering. Uh -huh. Okay, good, good. Excellent. Very good. Hello, Cesar. How are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening. How was your day? I was tired, but with a more energy, first begin the class, English class. Excellent, excellent. What did you do today? Mm, well, early, I drive by car. ¿Cómo se dice dejar a los niños a la escuela? Drop off the kids at school. Drop off kids of the school uh, after working in the bakery uh, in the afternoon. Uh, 
the re, come come back at the at the house with the kid, the mm -hmm. school. Okay. All right. So you were daddy chauffeur today. Excellent. Excellent. Good job. Good job. All right, guys. I hope that everybody is feeling good. I hope that you had a great day. And we are going to go ahead and get started. I would like for you to tell me what information do you remember about yesterday's class? What vocabulary, what expressions? Good evening. Uh, we were practicing uh, superlative and comparative. Excellent. Superlatives and comparatives, Jonathan, is correct. Who can tell me in what situation we use the superlative? And the situation when us uh, uh, was do a comparative between two things or any things. For example, uh, the the longer at uh, two countries. Excellent, excellent. Uh, for example, I say to you. Uh, for example, if I say to you, what is, or I could say, uh, which is the most expensive hotel in El Salvador. Or I say, which is more expensive? I'm here. Okay. Which is more expensive? Um, Burger King? or McDonald's, okay? So in the first example, we have the superlative. In the second example, we have the comparative. Now, for the next activity, we're going to be looking at questions of choice how to ask a choice. Interesting. Korea, Brazil, or Greece? Does anybody have any questions in regards to the pronunciation in this exercise? Questions in regards to the pronunciation in this exercise? Questions? Okay, I see somebody already sent it, good. Now, we're going to go ahead and move on to section number 4.9. On section 4.9, in this conversation, the use of questions with how will introduce, be introduced by asking about distance and measurements. In esta conversación, el uso de preguntas con cómo serán presentadas a través de preguntas relacionadas a distancia y medidas. Let's look at the next video. And here we're going to look at distance and measurements. Everybody listen and repeat. Distance and measurements. 
distance and measurements. Distance, distance and, and measurements. measurements. Excellent. Measurement. I want you to play the audio program and listen to the conversation. What are they talking about? Pay close attention. Listen and practice. I'm going to Australia next year. Aren't you from Australia, Beth? Actually, I'm from New Zealand. Oh, I didn't know that. So what's it like there? Oh, it's beautiful. It has lots of farms and it's very mountainous. Really? How high are the mountains? Well, the highest one is Mount Cook. It's about 3,800 meters high. Hmm. How far is New Zealand from Australia? Well, I live in Auckland, and Auckland is about 2,000 kilometers from Sydney. Well, maybe I should visit you next year, too. Did you get it? That's right. They are talking about distance and measurements using the... Hi, I want you to play the audio program and listen to the conversation. What are they talking about? Pay close attention. Listen and practice. I'm going to Australia next year. Aren't you from Australia, Beth? Actually, I'm from New Zealand. Oh, I didn't know that. So what's it like there? Oh, it's beautiful. It has lots of farms and it's very mountainous. Really? How high are the mountains? Well, the highest one is Mount Cook. It's about 3,800 meters high. Hmm. How far is New Zealand from Australia? Well, I live in Auckland, and Auckland is about 2,000 kilometers from Sydney. Well, maybe I should visit you next year, too. Did you get it? That's right. They are talking about distance and measurements using the question word how. Okay. We're going to be reviewing the conversation, listen and repeat. I'm going to Australia next year. Aren't you from Australia, Beth? I'm going, I'm going to, to Australia. Australia. I'm going to Australia next year. Australia. Would you are from Australia? Actually, I'm from New Zealand. Actually, Actually I'm, from I'm from New Zealand. Oh. I didn't know that. Oh, oh I didn't know. I didn't know, that. I didn't know that. So, what's it like there? So, what's, what's it like, like there? there? Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's, oh, it's beautiful. beautiful. It has lots of farms. It has a lot of farms. Oh, wow. And it's very mountainous. It is very, very mountainous. mountainous. Really? The highest one is Mount Cook. Really? really? The higher the mountains. Our mountain? Oh, sorry, sorry. My mistake. Really? How high are the mountains? Only really, really? high the mountains. Well, the highest one is Mount Cook. Well, the highest one is Mount Cook. Mount Cook. It's about three thousand eight hundred meters high. It's about, it's about 1,800 Hmm. How far mm. is New Zealand from Australia? Hmm. Mm. How far is New Zealand from Australia? Australia? Well, I live in Auckland. And Auckland is about 2,000 kilometers from Sydney. Well, well, I live in, I Auckland. Live in Auckland. And Auckland is about 2,000 kilometers for Sydney. For okay, okay. Ahí como que está lento el internet, dice. Se le escucha. Okay. Uh, uh, well, maybe I should visit 
you next year too. Well, well maybe, maybe I should be next year, next year, year, year too. year too. Okay. Now, at this moment, does anybody have any questions regarding the pronunciation or the meaning of the words that you saw in this conversation? Questions? Not for me, teacher. Anybody? Somebody? About this. About the conversation that we just uh, finished uh, practicing. Yes, I finish. I understand conversation. Okay, excellent. Anybody else? Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take about five minutes and I would like for you to practice the conversation back and forth. Uh, change the roles when you finish and then practice again. I want you to practice it about five times. And remember, try to intonate and try to pronounce the words similar like what you hear in the vocabulary. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. What is the topic? Yes, teacher. What is yes. the topic? The mountains, right? Asking for measurements. That's the topic, the mountains. I'm going to allow you to share your screen so that everybody can share their screen. Somos, okay. somos, somos cuatro, ¿verdad? Para que seamos cabal dos parejas. Sí, cuatro, uh -huh. creo que creo cuatro somos. Sí, ahorita estamos cuatro. Si gusta, uh -huh. eh, podemos empezar, si gusta. Vaya, está bien. Empieza usted. ¿Dónde, pues? Sí. Vaya. Yo soy Scott. Ajá, yo soy Beth. Eh, going to, I'm going to Australia next year. Aren't you from Australia, Beth? Actually, I'm from New Zealand. Oh, I didn't know that. So what's it like there? Oh, it's beautiful. It has a lot of farms and it's very mountain mountainous. Really? How high, how high are the mountains? Well, the highest one in Mount Cook, it's about 3,800 meters high. How far is New Zealand from Australia? Well, I live in Auckland, and Auckland is about 2,000 kilometers from Sydney. Well, maybe I, I should visit next year too. Si gustan compañeros, Glendy, Ricardo, sí. practican y ustedes y después, y después combinamos. Ajá, y después combinamos, cambiamos los roles. Ajá. Ah, ya, ya estuvo, ya terminaron. Ok. Sí. <ríe> Ahorita busco, es que estoy en teléfono, entonces tengo que estarme moviendo de pestaña en pestaña, espérenme. Okay. 
Ya estoy listo, I'm ready. No sé si la compañía. Okay. Está usted entonces. And yo voy a empezar entonces. Soy Scott. I'm going to Australia next year. And you from Australia, Bet. Actually, I'm from New, New Zealand. Oh, I didn't know that. So what it like there? Oh, it's beautiful. It has a lot of farms and it's very mountain. Really? How high are the mountains? Well, the highest one is Mount Cook. It's about... 3,000, how much? It's 3,800 3, uh -huh. meters 800. high. Okay. Mm, how far is New Zealand? New Zealand from Austra Australia? Well, I live in Auckland, and Auckland is about 2,000 kilometers for Sydney. Well, maybe I should visit you next year, too. Okay. Okay, si gusta, eh, Blendy, ahora, ahora si gusta, Boyón, si no hay problemas, con Glendy, y de ahí combinan los otros dos compañeros. Bueno, está bien. Okay. Okay, Glendy. Scott, I'm going to Australia next year. Aren't you from Australia, Beth? Actually, I'm from New Zealand. Oh, I didn't know that. So what is it like there? Oh, it's beautiful. It has lots of farm and it's very mountainous. Really? How high? Are the mountain? Well, the highest one is Mount Cook. It's about 3,800 meters high. Mm, how, how, how far is New Zealand from Australia? Well, I live in Auckland, and Auckland is about 2,000 kilometers from Sydney. Well, maybe I should visit your you next year too. Okay. Vaya, vamos con con Ricardo. Con Ricardo. Yes. Ahora usted está conmigo. All right, guys, is everybody finished? Is everybody finished? Is everybody finished? Okay, now for the next activity, what you are going to do is you are going to write a similar conversation over here in the discussion forum. Va a escribir una conversación similar a la que estábamos viendo. Puede estar describiendo, digamos, Honduras y Guatemala, o El Salvador y Costa Rica, or whatever, whatever city that you want to describe. It can be a personal experience, an experience that you lived. Maybe you visited another city and you want to share it with, compare it with San Salvador. Maybe that's a possibility. And you are going to write the conversation in the dialogue. Ready? Let's go.
le fallo yo parezco todo por no salgo de mi casa Sección 4, ¿eh? ¿Verdad? sí y el creo que es cuatro nueve cuatro punto diez es ¿Qué sería esto entonces? Quiero ver si es el bien mismo. Idea. Se mira. Sí. Como es emulada porque tengo un Huawei por ahí que es lenta. Ah, no, 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 no hay problema, no hay problema. ¿Cómo se llama en Play Store? Ah, pues sí, este es, creo. Ok, entonces. Sería aquí. ¿Cómo le ponemos? Uh, no sé, pero no sé qué vamos a describir, que país o no sé. Sí, pero. El problema es que, que yo no conozco otro país. O sea, no, no lo, ¿cómo lo pudiera describir si no...? Uh, dijo, dijo el teacher que podría ser país, uh, no sé, ciudad o departamento de aquí, no hay, también no hay problema. Sí, porque no hay país. <risa> podemos, <yo>. describir, <risa> podemos describir San Salvador y Chalatenango, San Salvador, San Miguel. No sé, un lugar donde ustedes hayan ido y se acuerden más o menos el... Ajá. Ahí de cómo describirlo. Chalate me sería fácil porque como ya estudio. Ah, bueno, pues vamos a chalate. Ahí nos, ay nos ayuda ahí para poder hacer. Sí, vamos a ver. Scott, I'm going to Australia. No, bien. Mmm. Mmm. Pero es. Ay, ando perdido. No sé qué describir. Sí, sí. Supongo que dice sí, ¿verdad? Eh, voy a ir a Australia el próximo año. Sí, así es. Y Aren, Aren, you from Australia, Beck? ¿qué significa? Si ella va a ir también o algo así. No, sí, creo que significa has estado, no. No eres como, creo que era. Ah, no eres de Australia. Ajá. Ah, no eres de Australia. La pregunta. Pero no tenemos que hacerlo exactamente con las mismas preguntas y todo que hay, ¿verdad? No, creo que no. Ay, bueno, bueno hay, hay algunos que solo la editan, pero no sé ustedes. Yo porque ando perdido, en serio, no sé qué describir. Pero a ver, puedo poner así como estoy estudiando en Chalatenango. Tenango. Luego sería así como tú eres de allá, ¿verdad? O... Oh. No sé, un lugar de Chalatenango que sea, por decirlo así, turístico. En Chalatenango lo que es más turístico son los, los ríos, más que todo, las montañas que están allá. El Pital, ah. La Palma, La Montañona, el río Zumpul. Ah, vaya, pues podremos, se podría hacer así, va. Um, uh, I want to, to go to... To the, ay, ¿cómo era? To, to, to the pital, to el pital. Y le puedes preguntar a, a la, otra persona, ¿has ido al, al pital antes? Ajá. Podría, voy a intentar hacer algo. ¿Cómo, cómo lo, lo cambio entonces? Eh, yo digo que sí, no, no llevamos mucho, pero... Para, o sea, para que sea más, algo más fácil, diría yo. Ajá, sería como, bueno, eso no lo voy a borrar. Ay. I'm going mm. to, eh, de pita. Mm. De pita. 
next, no, vamos a poner el próximo año, eh, precisamente ponemos next month, o semana, ¿cómo es? Weekend. Week. O week, week, en la Week, cosa. es verdad. Sí, week. Week es fin de es semana. Es fin de semana. Es week. Ya queríamos que sea fin de semana. Sí. <risa> Eso es. Aren, este, tú, tú eres. Mm. O le cambiamos cosas, podemos, podemos poner también, tú conoces o tú ya has ido a, al pitar. Yo, yo llevo una media, ahí va, una media Ajá. conversación, no sé, no sé si quieren que la comparta para sí, sí. saber si les parece. Sí, claro. Voy iniciando, no, no es mucho ni, ni idea que tú. Mm. Permítame. Okay. Um, eh, tratarlo de algo así, o sea, poner, digamos, un nombre aleatorio y uh -huh. Edward. Edward. Ah, Eduardo ahí. ¿Cómo digo? Eduardo. Um, eh, pongamos. Sí, María. ¿Abajo, María? Ajá. Mm. Vaya, y podríamos ponerle yes. ¿Lo de arriba lo dejo? Sí. Algo así. No sé si lo logran ver. Como okay. yo estoy compartiendo, creo que por eso no se mire. Ah, es cierto, es cierto, es ah. cierto. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ah, ya, yeah, permítame. Mm -hmm. Ahorita estoy viendo, creo que se pueden ver las dos pantallas. Solo se seleccionan. Ver? Ajá. Ah, ok. Uh. Se viene la que dice, hey, I want to go to el hospital. Sí. Exacto, y, uh, o sea, no, no es que sea muy larga, vamos a sacar una conversación de unos ¿qué? cuatro o cuatro, tres con párrafos de, bueno, di, uh, párrafos de diálogo de cada, de cada uno de los personajes. Uh -huh. Además, o sea, no es que sea mucho y tampoco tan cargado, algo, uh -huh. algo pequeño sería algo así, y es... Uh, uh, Así sería, o sea, hey, I want to go to, to El Pital. Have you ever gone to El Pital, Maria? Yes, I'm from Tenango. I've gone three times before. Y a ponerle. Era, hay que buscar ahí como qué tan helado estuvo, lo más helado que ha estado, no sé. O qué tan uh -huh. helado es. Uh -huh. A ver. Um, uh, no sé cómo no sé cómo ponerle ese mm. yo ahorita lo llevo así eh, voy a ir al hospital la próxima semana tú ya has ido ah uh, you ever gone to the hospital uh, y, y solo solo eso llevas o llevas o llevas más solo eso llevo ahorita es que le pondría a María que responda Yes, I have uh, to go to the hospital. No, sí, creo que sí, que sí. Uh, Details, creo que detalles, si no estoy mal. 
tengo un poco que sí, 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 sí. sí ya he ido very es... no consejo sería a país creo que consejo A ver, ah, ni modo. All right. Uh, I know that everybody is not finished. I know that some people are still working on the conversation, but it's time for us to move forward. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take the attendance. Please say present when I call your name. Adriana Grethel. Adriana. Grethel. Okay, Adriana Grethel is absent. Oh, Adriana Grethel is present. She's right here. Adriana, can you hear me? Hello, Adriana, are you there? Okay. Eh, no le puedo poner presente porque no dice nada. Así que absent. Andrea Esmeralda. Present. All right. Carlos William. The present. Okay. Cesar Alexander. Present. All right. Cristian Oswaldo. Cristian. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Claudia Jocelyn. Present. Okay. David Alonso. Present. Thank you. Freddy Jose. Freddy Jose is absent. Glendy Elisette. Present. Okay. Iris Janet. Present teacher. All right. Teacher uh, Gretel says uh, she's here. Uh, where? Oh, Adriana. Okay. Uh, in, the, in the chat, yes. Okay, ya lo vi. Okay, thank you, Jonathan. So, Grethel is present. Estadio Yente. Freddy absent. 
Irving Hiroki. Irving. Okay, Irving is absent. Jonathan Vladimir. Present. Jonathan. Okay. Present, present. Present. Oh, Josue Miguel. Present. Carla Tatiana. Presente. Catherine Jasmine. Present teacher. All right. Lisbeth Martinez. Present. Luisa Ariana. Present. Luz Virginia. Mayra Patricia. Present teacher. Okay. Melissa Guadalupe. Melissa Guadalupe. Absent. Nerlin Haciel. Teacher. Dijo la compañera que acaba de mencionar que está ausente, que ahí está. En el chat acaba de publicar. Melissa Guadalupe. Sí, ella. Ah, ok. Melissa Guadalupe. Nerlin Haciel. Presente, teacher. Present. Ricardo Fabricio. I hear teacher. Yancy Yamilet. Present teacher. Excellent. Okay. All right, guys. I know that everybody is not finished. That's your homework if you are not finished. Right now, we're going to go ahead and move forward and we're going to take a look at the next section which is by the end of this session, you will learn to ask and answer questions with how. Al final de esta sesión, aprenderán a hacer preguntas con qué tan y a dar respuestas. Questions with how. Everybody here? Hi again. There are many can questions we hear? can ask with how. This can time we'll hear? ask questions related yes. to distance, measurement, descriptions, and conditions. As soon as we listen to the explanation, we'll ask you some questions. Get ready. Questions with how. How far is New Zealand from Australia? It's about 2,000 kilometers, 1,200 miles. How big is Singapore? It's 648 square kilometers, 250 square miles. How high is Mount Cook? It's 3,740 meters high, 12,250 feet. How deep is the Grand Canyon? It's about 1,900 meters deep, 6,250 feet. How long is the Mississippi River? It's about 5,970 kilometers long, 3,710 miles. How hot is Auckland in the summer? It gets up to about 23 degrees Celsius, 74 degrees Fahrenheit. How cold is it in the winter? It goes down to about 10 degrees Celsius, 50 degrees Fahrenheit. We will use how to ask different types of questions. We will use how this way. How plus adjective plus verb plus complement plus question mark. Let's go back to the chart. Notice how and right after it we have far. Far is an adjective. How big. Big is an adjective. 
and because we use adjectives we must use the verb be properly conjugated how long is the mississippi river how is the question word long is the adjective is is the verb be in singular mississippi river is the complement ready to answer here we go how big is your country how tall are you which one is the longest river in your country how long is it as we always ask you to do please write your responses in our discussion box it goes down all right guys we're going to go ahead and uh, take a look at the section right here we're gonna look at the first part where it says, how far is New Zealand from Australia? So what is the meaning of how far? What is the meaning of how far? Very good, very good. In this case is, que tan lejos esta New Zealand from Australia? The next one is, how big? is Singapore. Que tan grande is Singapore. Eh, how high is Mount Cook? Que tan alto is Mount Cook? How deep is the Grand Canyon? Que tan profundo is el Gran Cañón? How long is the Mississippi River? Que tan largo is el Rio Mississippi? How hot is Oakland, Oakland in the summer? Que tan caliente es Oakland en el verano? How cold is it in the winter? Que tan frío es en el invierno? So, me van a escribir one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven examples, uno utilizando how far, y usted diga los países, uno utilizando how big, how, how high, how deep, how long, how hot, y how cold. La respuesta no es necesaria. Ahorita solo quiero ver que pueda hacer la pregunta. And when you finish, you are going to write it here in the discussion box. Any questions? Any eso questions? Lo vamos a hacer, eso lo vamos a hacer en la plataforma. That is correct. Para los que están trabajando en el celular, hágalo en su libreta para después pasarlo a su plataforma. Okay. Ready? Let's go. Está bien, así se aprende. Este, voy a compartir la imagen para tener una referencia. Permito. Eh, quiero ver. Uh, show. <coughs> eh, la pueden ver. <coughs> ya está un poco borrosa. Mm, sí, pero lo único importante ahí es how far, how big, how high, how deep, how long, how hot, and how cold. How long is the... How long is the... ¿Qué, qué tan largo? Ajá, uh -huh. how long uh -huh. is the... Is the what the river? Eh, sí, escríbalo en el chat si quiere. Puede. Mm -hmm. Ajá. Eh, Nerlin, no sé si también está, este, y si puede escribirlos en el chat. Ah, voy a escribir yo aquí uno. How far? Uh, how 
How far is it in the Canadian? Is uh, so so nothing from a kind. Ahí puse una con relación a how, how far. Solo que se me olvidó poner el, el signo de interrogación. Ah, vaya, este, pero ahí estoy viendo el ejemplo. Eh, how cold is in the, in the winter? Pero winter es para... Es que winter, winter es el invierno. Ajá, entonces quiere decir qué tan frío es el invierno. Ah, pero podríamos decir también qué tan frío es en Canadá. How Ajá. cold is in the Canadian? Sí, qué tan frío es esta, esta Canadá. Voy a ver si lo puedo poner. How cold eh, is Canadá? Uh, On December voy a poner. How cold, ¿Qué tan frío es Canadá en diciembre? Ahí lo puse en el chat. Eh, no sé si tienen otras. A ver. Quiero ver. How, eh, big is, is, how big is. Um, for example, how big is the US? Ah, sí, se puede. How high is Pitao Mountain? Ahí pongo otro con relación a how high, qué tan alto es la montaña, el pital o el cerro, el pital. Ajá, este se puede poner este USA U.S. punto ya yeah, uh -huh. sería. Puede poner USA, e, puede poner e, e, u, u también. Pone ah. e, e punto u, u. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. eh, Dios, el chat. Qué raro se me borró el chat. How hot, qué tan caliente, por ejemplo. How hot? Eh, ¿Qué tan caliente? Is El salvador. Your... Ah, no, pero aquí puedo poner eh, How hot is your coffee? ¿Qué tan caliente está tu café? No sé por qué se borró lo demás que habíamos puesto en el chat, bien raro. O no, ya me salió. Eh, how deep significa qué tan profundo podría ser how deep mm. how deep is eh, the cup the 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 is the No, pero mm. 
¿Verdad que ¿Qué tan lejos vive, vives de aquí? Sí, ¿qué tan lejos vives de aquí? How far do you live from here? We try, teacher, we try. England. Sí. <laughs> How big is England? Salimos de aquí y nos vamos para el grupo de clase. No están llamando. ¿Por qué? Todavía no. Ya van a ser las 10, no sé. Él, él hace una invitación para que nos vayamos y a mí no me sale. Ah, bueno. Bueno, yo ya puse la mía, mi oración. Oh, God. qué tan caliente es en la playa. Yo que no le puedo poner una foto a mi perfil aquí para en vez de, cuando no quiera poner la cámara, pongo la, poner la foto. ¿Ah? Pero no hay cómo poner la foto. No. Okay, guys, is everybody finished? Yes. Okay, for the people that did not finish, that's going to be your homework. At this moment, does anybody have any questions about this activity? No one for me. Anybody, anybody? Somebody, one body? Somebody, nobody? You body, one body, everybody, about, about what? anybody, somebody, one body, two body, nobody, I'm nobody, nobody, teacher, but... nobody, nobody. All right, all right. Thank you, guys. We're gonna go ahead and stop right here, and we will see you again tomorrow. Good night, guys. Bye bye. Good night, Good night. Good night everyone. Bye, bye teacher. Bye. Thank you. Bye bye.